All right, uh, we got uh, Razor, the fucking oh, Razor here. Oh, what what uh, like what's your prediction for the fight against uh, Thor crazy. versus Devin? The mountain like versus No is. Limits. I'd have to go with No Limits on that one. You know, the mountain's a bigger dude well, for sure, but that guy's a straight killer, man. I'm going with the Canadian. Fuck Iceland, Larat all the fucking way, buddy. Let's go, Razor, baby. All right, Rich. I uh, got a question for you, brother. In the new in the match coming up between Thor and Devin, who do you think is gonna win? What round? And what do you think is gonna happen? I'm from Ottawa. There's only one man to win this match. So I think it's crazy. Five weeks out, but I think everyone knows anything coming out of the valley, anything coming out of Ottawa is a little bit crazy. So do I think he's gonna win? Ah, man. That's a dangerous man right there. Doesn't matter what he goes into. Thanks, Rich. All right, we're here with the uh, one and only Alan Ford. Alan, I need to get your prediction on the upcoming match between Thor and Devin. What do you think is going to happen? Who are they? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, no. Wow. Yeah, Devin. I don't know. Devin, he's literally a killer. Literally. I mean, he's going to fucking kill him. There's no way. I just hope. I hope he stays within the rules. That's my only. My only worry. What round do you think everything's gonna go down? I know round one's gonna be very interesting. Like that's gonna. Uh, the Devin. Best. Devin in round one. Yeah, I mean Devin's got the endurance. I know he doesn't have the endurance for this, but his endurance, I think, is gonna. It's gonna carry him forward through. So I think it's gonna be very similar to arm wrestling, like where he just out. Well, either he's that or he's going to knock him right out in the first round. <laughs> knock but out I mean, first if I, round. If that doesn't happen, because I don't know the experience that uh, Thor has. I know he's got a bit more than Devin, for sure, like in actual boxing, as far as I know. Um, but, but yeah, he's going to... If, if it doesn't, doesn't happen in the first round, he's going to... Uh, he's going to kill him uh, like in, with endurance. Deadly. Yeah. Good luck, Devin. Awesome. Kick his ass! All right, we got the one and only Curtis Cameron here. Uh, Curtis, I got one question for you. Who do you think is going to win in the upcoming match between Thor and our boy Devin Laird? Oh, I'm going to pick Devin on this one. He's a real killer, you know. He's in TriStar Gym in Montreal. He's got, what, five weeks to train? Yep. So he's going to just fucking take it all in, absorb all that, focus on that one thing. He's going to bring stamina. He's a fast learner. Killer instinct. You know, the deeper rounds, I think Devin will bleed him a little bit. As long as he doesn't play into his reach. Thor's got that reach. Devin's got to get inside, come up top, bang, bang. Nighty night. In out. I think that's how it could go. So. Deadly. What round? He'll do her. What round do you think? I'm hoping round, I'm going to say round three. Round three with a knockout or? Yeah, I think yep. Thor's going to just give up. Hopefully. Deadly. Right on. Thanks for your time, Chris. All right, now I got Freddy here. Freddy, I got a question for you, brother. What's up, buddy? Uh, so the upcoming match between Thor and Devin. I want your prediction, what's going to happen, and what round? That's a lot of questions. Sorry, uh, brother. I think uh, I'm going to go with Devin's going to crush it. He's a veteran. And Thor's a big man. But Devin's going to find an edge. And he's going to win the match. Bring it home for Canada. For the Valley. Hey, yay! Yeah, buddy. That's it. Um, second round. Second round? Second knockout? Second round knockout, yeah. Second round knockout. Deadly. Yeah, Thanks, sure. Freddy. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Now we got Mike Smith here. We're going to get your prediction, Mike, on what you think is going to happen across seas with Devin Laird and Thor. You know, uh, you know Thor's little, like, his little, like this? Oh, yeah. His face is all, all fucked up there. That's going to be his whole face. Devin's going to fuck him up. First, he's going to play with him round one. He's going to feel out that Thor is a little bitch. And then, a couple rounds in, he's going to turn it on. And then Thor is going to become this. But the whole thing, that's what's going down. Deadly Mike, thanks for your time, brother. No worries. All right, so I got the fucking famous... BLM here. Oh, I got one question for you, BLM. Yeah, buddy, what's going on? So the match between Thor and our boy Devin. What do you think is gonna happen? Oh, what round? 
I don't know, but I, but I put it this way, all right? I don't know Thor. I, all I know about him is how he's strong he is and his power, and that's his game, his power and his strength. Devin, I know him personally. He's a really good friend. I see how hard he trains. I see how bad he, when he wants something, I know how hard he works for it. I can see it in his eyes how bad he wants something. Like, you know what I mean? I see him training harder than other guys. Constantly, 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 constantly. I see guys taking breaks, the guys still still pulling. He's, I see guys not going out partying on the weekends, the guys aren't wrestling training. When he wants something, he, he gets it because he works for it. He puts more time in than the other guy. That's all I can know a judge by because that's all I know by Devin. I think if he simply, I know he's only got five weeks for this fight, but in the five weeks, if he dedicates and trains as hard as I know he can train, I can't see him beating him. He's a natural athlete. He's got hard of the lion and uh, he always finds a way to win. That's the way with Devin and his arm wrestling. He finds a way to win. He's a grinder. The way I look at it, Thor is big. He's gonna be slow. But the thing is, Devin's a big guy too. Devin's not a small guy. It's gonna be it's gonna be a weird match. It's it's, uh, it's weird. And another thing I'm, I have to put into perspective is Devin's arms, right? Devin can't really pull fully straighten his arms. True. So you might have some issues. Maybe with a little straight punching in a hook. Maybe. Uh, have a better chance with that, but I don't see if he, as long as he gets trained with the proper guys and um, with the proper coaching. I know he's training with the TriStar Gym in yep. Montreal. I mean, TriStar can't get much better than that. Oh, so. Exactly. I put it this way: I think Devin is will find a way to win this match. I'm not, I can't really predict how it's going to go, what round, whatever. I think if he trains hard enough, he'll probably have better cardio. The guy's been running; he's not yep. running competition. Exactly. You know what I mean? I think he can last the rounds opposed to Thor with his bigger mass, bigger body. He'll be hard for him to last the rounds. Definitely. I say Devin will win. I don't think everyone's going to get knocked out. I don't think there's going to be any of that. I think they... But you never know. I mean, Devin's... He sees red. He sees red. That's it. Can't judge it. That's we it. We can't judge it. That's why it's going to be such a good match. I'm excited to watch it, man. Awesome, I, man. But I got Devin for the win. He'll find a way to win. Let's not, go. Yeah, not necessarily going to knock each other out, but he will last the rounds if that's what it's going to take. Deadly. Awesome, Mohill. Thanks for your time, brother. Yeah, brother. I'm in All right. Life. Yeah. Mr. Brad. Yeah. You seen the sparring session that uh, our man Devin had? Yes. Yeah, what do you think? I saw enough of it. Uh, Has well, your never, opinion changed? Well, I said before that I think he was going to stop him in three. Devin was going to stop Thor in three. No. No. I, I don't know. There's some foot issues you were saying to me a couple seconds ago, right? Well, when he's moving and it's... I'm not a boxer, but... Not looking good. I hope, I'm, I hope, I hope he's trolling. <laughs> I hope he's trolling, man. I really do. Thanks, Brad. All right, Smitty it. You watched the Devin sparring session? Yeah. What do you think, buddy? I think that Devin's always got something up his sleeve. His matches, everything he does, he takes everything he can he can get, and uh, he's got some tricks. So you think he's fucking around? Yeah, for and, sure. And looking he like a pile of shit. I messaged him and he's like, I suck. And I don't know, I was like, no, that's not him. He's got some shit. Excellent. Good stuff. Ooh. Mr. Razor. I'm blinded by the lights. Hey, how are you? <laughs> um, uh, so, no limits. Devin, Lerat, Thor, Thor Horgus on there, Iceland motherfucker, the mountain. If I'm going to put money on it, which I am tomorrow, whole paycheck. I got paid 560 I swamp furniture, it's all going on Lerat. That's how much fucking I know he's going to fucking win, man. <laughs> Listen here, motherfucker. The buy or not, we're fucking high hookers. Yeah. Alright, Devin, you fuck. Fuck. You seen the sparring session? Devin's with... recent sparring video? Yeah, his uh, elite footwork. Um, I don't want to, like, start bashing on my buddy or nothing. So, you ask me questions and I'll answer. How's that? Okay. Who do you think Not is going to win? <laughs> Sorry, what? That was way too fast. I, I wasn't sure the question. I just knew it wasn't Devin. It wasn't going to be Devin. Oh, my God. I'm going to bash on the video. Jesus Christ. 
Do you have any, have you ever watched boxing? Oh yeah. Have you ever watched amateur boxing? Uh, a couple matches. I watch a lot of amateur boxing, and I have never seen anything this bad. Like, what, what, what's that? It used to be called. Uh, so, you, do you want to fight? Or what the fuck was that? So you want to fight because you think you're tough? Yes, yeah. that's the one. Yeah, it's a tough man contest. Yeah. And those guys would probably win a boxing match against Devin. Devin moves like a better boxer than these guys that have never done anything. He's got five weeks of training. When I said, I think Devin's going to kill this dude just because he's got X factors that you can't teach, right? And he is... He's a fucking killer. He will go after it. He's not afraid... Of anything, you know what he's done in his career and his life. He's not afraid to fight this man, and he needs to fight this guy because he can't box for the shit. I said Thor's a terrible boxer, and that's why Devin's gonna win. But that's because I didn't know how fucking bad Devin was a boxer. I would watch his last sparring video specifically to look at like his head movement, his footwork, and he scores a negative three on both of them. Now, do you think that Devin's playing mind games? If he is, I have thought about this because Devin does like doing this little troll and shit. He, he fucks around a lot of things, you know. Like he wouldn't post his real weight, getting ready for Michael Todd. He, he does do stuff like this. If he is trolling, and that sparring is that bad. Not for real. That is an act. He can actually make himself look that fucking awkward. Then he is the fucking man, and this is the greatest troll job that has ever happened in any sport. It was incredible for a guy to go from arm wrestling at that level into boxing at a lower and make it look even fucking. Nobody can look that fucking awkward that knows how to fight. They can't make themselves do these stupid ass movements that he's doing. There's no way. It's got to be real. With all that being said, I still think Devin can win the fight. He's just a tougher person mentally than Thor. Thor wouldn't be able to keep up if Devin just keeps walking him down. Nobody punches well walking backwards, especially that lumbering fucking oaf. Thor still isn't any good. Devin's just worse. But as long as Devin keeps walking forward and making Thor walk backwards, just make it a fucking fist fight. When that bell goes, walk into the center of the ring and make it a fucking fist fight. Walk at him and throw punches until that motherfucker has no choice but to back down. And he can still win the fight. And I think that's what he's going to do. He's just going to be the tougher guy. But he's fucking terrible. <laughs>